Welcome back to the Legacy of Nos. This is art. But we have other things on our uh, agenda than admiring art today, so let's go out the front door. There's a guard wandering around out here, but he should be hopefully reasonably calm now. I haven't really looked around the southern side of this area, have I? <gasps> nice flowers. Why would there be anybody here? What a ridiculous idea. That guard I'm hearing. Maybe up through that window, okay. There's a beam there with a rope. Well, I want to cross these rails, but I need this guy to start heading away first. Oh, and this. Hurry up, my patience is not unlimited. Ships, metal there. Oh, the guard isn't coming this way. Maybe I can just make the jump. He's looking this way. Alright. No, I don't think I can make the jump to that. To that rope, that's uh, a little too far away. A little too high. And I would land with a tremendous clang. On that bridge. I mean, this continues further south. I thought we were at the southern end of the map here. Is somebody down here? Let's break in and see if they've got anything for us. I should look into that. Good idea. Somebody really should look into it. Valuable. No, this is. Oh, carrots, cucumbers. Well, they're not worth a lot of money, but they, they're of value to me at least. You've really got a straw floor with a fire right there? That's. You're putting the whole city at risk, man. With your interior decorating choices. So is she not coming downstairs? Now it sounds like she is. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna go upstairs. That's not. <gasps> Thought she was coming back up again. Ability and etiquette in bone. <sighs> He's coming upstairs, guy. Okay. No. Doesn't seem to be anything else in here, so let's go out onto this balcony. Ah, 
красиво, я. Map. Right, yes. So I don't want to keep hitting west just yet. I want to come up here. Well, actually. Yeah, I want to go back to the sewers. I want to go back to the sewers that we found. Was it under the inn? I don't remember. Great. I'm just sitting smell this guy's parts for the next 10 minutes. Machinery. But by God, there were servants to take care of things proper. What are you doing there, man? I need to go that way. Get those hands up, or I'm gonna put you down. What the fuck? <laughs> How the fuck did you see me there? Ugh, that's annoying. Alright, well... Just turn around and saw me. It's ridiculous. You know what? I'm gonna try swimming. Still stuck on the ladder. Garrett being fucking noisy as shit. Alright, well got back to the sewers that I tried that I wanted to get back to, so that's I guess the good news. In fact I found the very door that I had missed before. Right, I'm gonna go take this rope back. Oh this is not my rope. I see. Alright, well I guess going in any of those pipes is out of the question. Let's try going this way. Oh, it's just another canal, okay. Oh, I see another sewer pipe, let's investigate. Maybe this is where we need to be. the hideout in the sewers I was looking for. This is the castle. Well, you know, this was... was another place on my agenda, I suppose. Lady Carmilla, discover what she knows about the, uh, the steel door beneath the theatre? Sure. I guess, since we're here. Is that you? 
That, damn it. Thank you. You, you stay away from me! <laughs> ah, I'm getting seen all over the shop by people who shouldn't be able to detect me. I wonder if the uh, default AI has been tweaked. I'd be annoyed if so, because... Maybe it wasn't quite dark enough to... Guards didn't see me at least. Not even guarding their own money. This seems more like her, her room, right? This is clearly a guard's room with a sword there. Yeah, you ever saw me. Hello. Sante. Oh. We can just open it directly or we can wind the long thing to open it. That's weird. And why do you have this in your kitchen? Strange. Hmm. Okay. Hello? You're suspicious. Hope there's another switch on this side. Oh, I can reach that switch from here. Let's go. Walk the path until my return to eternal fire. What? What is going on down here? Necromancy? I hear some zombies. I'm going to leave this mystery just for the moment. See what we can find out from Lady Shadwell herself. Lady Shadwell, was that it? Lady Shadwell. Shadewall Castle. Lady Carmella. <sighs> Nothing on your bookcase. Why he suddenly got riled up there? Why don't you seem to have calmed down? Let's take that while we wait. Maybe he heard a damn footstep on the tile floor.
Or is he coming going or is he going around in circles? Circles, I think, okay. Maleficia Oblivionis. Redex Daimonum Advocatio. She certainly has an interest in necromancy. The sorceries of Calabash the Black. How about this? The Playwright's Guide to Clever Sounding Words. A gentleman with a thistle down hair. I think this one actually is worth an hour. Is that you? There's guards patrolling, there's a couple of guards looking around. Oh, and they're going back and forth, okay. Dun, 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 dun. How far do they go? So the top floor of the castle then. Somebody else walking around up here too. Okay, they just walk up and down the battlements. That makes sense, it's a good place for an archer to be patrolling, right? Yeah, coming back again. Yeah. Oh, the old footsteps I'm hearing, I think it's downstairs. Oh, somebody coming up? Okay, now I'm good. I'll take your apple, sir. Okay, well, we have the possibility to head west. Precariously. I'm not sure I like the idea. Or precar precariously around there as well. There's another door there. No. C. <laughs> we could put that fire out. What's this guy looking at? Well, seems clear. Something moved there. Nope. on the eight crystals of power. The tales about the crystals' origins are numerous and contradictory. Some say they were a star that fell to Earth, while others claim our precursors made them. It's also said they formed quite naturally in long-lost caves below the crags cleft peaks. The simple fact is, no one knows for sure, and all that we can say is that they are conduits for the powers of magic, and thus practitioners of the arcane for many years have fought and died to own these powerful and priceless artifacts. As such, a lot of them have now been lost and only three are still accounted for. Though made of unknown magic minerals, the crystals all resemble precious stones. The similar appearances have led the crystals to be named for coloured gems. 
The Zircon has been recently acquired by members of the Handmaid's Brotherhood, who guard it jealously within their keep. The crystal called the Amethyst is held by Malazar the Conjurer, who keeps it locked away within his forest home and uses it for strange experiments. The Moonstone has been held for centuries by Dryads of the Sky God Tenagur, who keep it in the Fortress of the Lake. Of all the others, very little is known. The Black Opal was for a time held in the mountain fortress known as Raven's Reach, but it was stolen many years ago. The Emerald was once believed to be possessed by Nos the Necromancer, but upon his death no trace of it was found. The Topaz and the Ruby and the Sphene have not been heard of since the Elder Days. The dream of any power-hungry mage would be to find them all and draw from them such magic as the world has never seen. Hello, I see a switch up there. Can I reach it without making a huge clatter here? Hmm. What does that do? Is that supposed to... No idea what that it does. That's uh, not the way secrets are supposed to work. Well, I can reach it from here without jumping, so I guess that's what I'm going to try and do. Hello. It's strange. I thought there was something there. Vent. I'm gonna have to go back and check that lever in a minute, but um, let's just take us I heard something. out to the street somewhere. I'm oh, still heading west. Okay. Yes, yeah, looks like we're above the west gate. Friend is standing right outside the door. Spider. Who's there? No. Oh. I did not notice that when I was out there, okay. Well, this still doesn't answer my question about what that switch does. What does this switch do? Damn it! I'm not kidding around. <laughs> hey, come on at once. Come back here and fight! Don't worry, I'll fight you. Imagined it. <coughs> so, I ask again, <laughs> what does this switch do? 
Now I can't reach it. There we are. Leave! That's it. You've had it. God, you were walking the other way. How did you end up there? Don't you were walking. Think you can hide for long. I just have to knock you out. Uh -oh. He's around there somewhere. Wasted two water arrows here already. One peep out of you, and that's it. Peep. Fortunately, being in this position means I don't really get good directional sounds. There's an intruder around here. Oh, great, he's one riled up too now. Yeah, I'm just gonna knock you guys out. It's just like this is. Oh. Gonna take me too long, otherwise, you know. I need to hunt around, I need to make noise, I need to find what the fuck this switch is opening. Can't remember if it's switched on or off right now. Right, I hear something moving. Is that a statue? Yeah, okay, there's that statue. Ah. Right. Valuable gem. Okay. Right. Well. Maybe you guys neglected your duties in here. And we're outside on the balconies carousing. Yeah. And you let someone break in. Too busy drinking, you let someone break in and steal all this stuff. And look, you even left your bottles here. Guys. Terrible. Okay, I've been down that staircase. I haven't been down this one. safer in here than in there. Theatre key. Since I acquired the theatre on the site where Nossus Tower stood in elder days, my knowledge of his powers has increased, but I am still a novice next to him. The plains of death are still all veiled to me. I dare not brave the catacombs to find his ancient tome of lichcraft where it lies among the restless dead that guard his tomb, for though I can bring corpses back to life, I am yet to master powers of control. I cannot shackle them to do my will, and so I'd surely die there were I to try to brave the haunted depths to take the book. And so instead I try to focus on the door within the caves that lie below. No pickaxe or explosives make a dent, and there is magic shielding I can sense. The thing that I need most in all the world is that small stone that surely fits the lock. It's not within the theatre, I'm sure, but maybe it was sold along with all the other junk that Crispin tried to pawn before I took the building off his hands. I sense our deathly power far below, his power crystal locked beneath the earth, and if I could break in, I'd surely find the means to thwart this sheriff and his men, and rise again among the halls of power until this city grovels at my feet. Ezekiel had far too small a mind to dare to dream of anything so bold. His lack of vision and his stubborn ways have ended with the executioner. Now I'm in charge, I won't make his mistakes. 
Home of Litchcraft in the catacombs. Okay. New objectives. Um, recover the keystone? No. Break into the theatre, use the stone to seal the portal? Yeah. Carmela believes that the Sanctum holds Nossus Crystal of Power. Such a prize would be dangerous and valuable. Find it. Not the cup, Garrett. Always grab the wrong thing. Banners. Banners that are fake. Cursed. Any kind of secrets in this library? I don't think so. Doesn't look like this. There's something up there, though. No, it's just the texture. Alright. Mm, strange. Close. Fucking me, these guards are uh, not too alert. What about her bed chambers? She really likes uh, bones and things, doesn't she? Guards patrol is like. No, I'm afraid it's, the answer might be not good. He surely won't come in here. Her private chambers. Food and getting the, getting some beer and going out. He will stand outside and mutter and grumble. Though. That's. That's within his. Uh, remit of his job. Okay. He's standing nearby, so let's be quiet in here. And she likes the green man as well. I don't really want to burn one here. I'll wake them to start heading down this hallway and then we'll just go out behind him carefully. Quickly and quietly and not make a mistake. Drama and the arts in modern times. The many legends of the ancient ward of Grey Twist Merking can be heard throughout the city's many taverns, inns, and pubs. And while there is no doubt some truth behind the tales of Nos and Necromancer's reign, embellishment has obfuscated them until we can't decipher what was true and what the drunken ramblings of a loon. A story of more certainty of truth is that of Lord Vasari and his gems. They were the brightest jewels, it is said, that miners in the earth have ever found. So proud was Lord Vasari that he built a vault of steel beams and tempered glass to keep the jewels safe while on display. He boasted that the gems were safe from thieves until the day a burglar took them all. A common thief named Pritchett stole the gems. He partnered with Vasari's butler, George, who knew the combination to the vault. Vasari had his man put to the rack. The spineless wretch soon gave his partner up and Pritchett found his time was running out. They caught him as he tried to flee the city and tortured him until his dying breath. 
All he revealed was that the gems were close. In great were smirking, he had hidden them. Now treasure hunters, even to this day, search all the oldest buildings of the ward in hopes of finding Lord Viserys' gems. But to this date, not one has come to light. The gem's intrinsic value would of course today be supplemented by the tale, and if all three were found, collectors would undoubtedly be at each other's throats to buy them for the legend they've become. Lord Bessari's gems, sir. Hmm, 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 hmm. Is that something I should be hunting for? Sounds like it might be something to be found. Oh, that's the stairs down. Okay, I don't want to go down just yet. At least one more room up here to explore. Well, I want to go to that end of the hallway. Maybe there's no room to say. I can't see. Right, he's going to come down to this end of the hallway. Turns to go around down the long hallway, then we uh, follow him, check out the other end, and then come back down here and down the stairs. My dear Camilla, I have searched and searched but cannot find more than a worthless scrap. The only little thing that I could find that spoke about the Library of Gaal was scribbled in the margin of a book that otherwise was quite innocuous, a farmer's almanac from 42. It said in letters barely legible, No earthly fears shall visit me at night, for I have seen the Library of Gaal, and read the words of some around the fair. In dreams I wander down his sacred halls, and every night the words consume my soul. I still think that it must be fictional, and these accounts are mere apocrypha. There's not a word about the place in Lamb, and Fredrickson is equally silent. If I were you, I wouldn't place my hopes in cryptic notes and vague, elusive words when right below your feet there lies a door with something tangible locked up within. At least we know the necromancer Nos existed and was mighty powerful. How goes your progress breaking down the seal? And what about the keystone? Any sign? Do let me know if I can be of use. Research, of course, but also company. I did enjoy our recent rendezvous. Your friend and confidant, Sir Vildefort. Hmm... Well, the Library of Gold. Maybe that's another thing to be found that I don't know. Or maybe it's just nothing. Uh, this doesn't seem to contain any hints, but... Uh, dreams. Cut. I can't take it, so I'm going to assume... It's not relevant. Maybe this is also just another legend of the place. Not... Not information of value. Who knows? You never really know, right? Until it's too late. My wanderings upon the plane of fire. Oh, that's Lady Amelia herself. Where did she go? Oh, there she is. See what she knows. You know, we could knock her on her head and see what she knows, but that's perhaps too unsubtle. Days of Uldor Citadel. Mm 
more to this library, I guess. Where is she? Dust, Arcana, and Ephemera. I should make him straight back in here. There may be nothing I need in here, of course. It's maybe the old dusty tomes that. Have nothing of value for me. Kept. Oh, she didn't notice that, thankfully. Yes. So, did she leave the library? No, there's someone else there. Been here before. Hmm. Thought I heard something. Dancing is the fae beyond the stones. Hang on. That was terrible timing. I'll find you. Just you wait. You're a pin. Dang it. Go to sleep. Ow, that hurt a lot. <laughs> well, because he came through the door a fraction too soon. And also because I misremembered, I thought you uh right. Too, I thought you went around in circles rather than uh sorry, I thought you went back and forth rather than around in circles. Could have just waited in this room and... Uh, oh well. Right, that goes back up to the upper floor. We've been there. We have to get back down again. Right, here's where we came in from the sewers, so the, uh, that's the statue, that's where we need to go. Whoa, careful door, Garrett. Be, be wary of those doors, they have some cursed magic about them. Can't reach it from that side. 
Okay. We have a book to find. Passageway right there. I don't know if this fellow is going to look away long enough for us to reach through and grab that. was a false vision. He couldn't really turn away properly, does he? Something is amiss. Sweet silence returns. Shakes. You know what? I've got all this food, I might as well eat some of it, right? Just wondering about healing potions, but... I shall walk the path to my God, that was way too close for comfort there, mate. I didn't realise you went in there. Okay, I think that's all my food, yeah. Well, that's a more respectable number of hit points. The latest background checks are now complete, and many that audition must be told that they are not what we are looking for, or far too many of them would be missed by friends and family that care for them. Just two of the latest batches suitable. One girl, a sorry waif, who wandered in with dreams of stardom in her desperate eyes, but not a person in the world who'd care if she were never to be seen again. The other is a man of meagre skill at singing for the drunken tavern crowds, who all will think has simply travelled on to other pubs in other parts of town. We've done the rituals to bind their souls and let the boys have fun in killing them. The latest incantations seem to work. Carmela will be pleased with these results. Well, that's these two here, is it? I shall walk the path to my return to Hmm. Oh, this is this is not the catacombs. This is merely Is it this is merely her dungeon? This is the catacombs. No, this is the sewers. Is there a lever on this side? Or is that a one way only? Ah, there is. Okay. I see you there. To waste an arrow. There's more of them. I might be wasting some arrows after all. You get an arrow, that's for sure. Damn things. Ah, uh, poor, poor fellow. Hmm. 
I mean, I've got 15 arrows, I don't really have anything else to use them on, do I? Could sneak past the spider, but no, my 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 policy is unchanged. Easier to hit them with a sword, slightly than the blackjack if it's longer. Careful, cat. These stairs are metal. Oh no, he's walking on metal. Who are you, sir? You're not a guard. Are you a sewer worker? Were you one of the, uh... The crew that we're looking for? Out, shall we? While working in the sewers, you see lots of things you'd rather not observe again. While I've been down here, I've seen several rats the size of docks and spiders that would make the hairs of any builder faring man stand up on end. But most of them are gone, and now I see some even larger beasts. The criminals that once would stalk the streets have now been driven by the zealous watch to hide like filthy rats down here with us. They mostly leave us be and let us work, but I'm more scared of them than any rat. For all it takes is one ill-favoured look, and I'll be stabbed and left to drown in shit. You're not wrong. Oh, okay, we got a lot more sewer to explore this direction. Maybe I should see what's out this other door. What's in what's through this door? Passages actually. I thought it was just one room, but no, there must be more there. Right, we'll go this way first anyway, there's more darkness. Less damn metal catwalks. Maybe it all joins up anyway, who knows. This might be an entrance. It sounds like there might be a guard up here as well. This probably goes to the streets. Whoops, that's, that's just the right hotkeys here. Not trying to flash bomb the door, it usually doesn't work on the locks. Yeah, that's the streets. Okay. Friend appears to be coming this way. Leave him to deal with that stuff. Ah. Try not to get stuck or make too much noise. Alright, let's head out this side then. Easier than I expected, but it seems okay. Moss. Oh, thank, thank. Uh, I say thank builder, but the builder doesn't like moss. Thank the trickster. It's kind of a little beyond the pale for even for me.
God. Can I, can't you fucking... Climb? What the fuck? You better hope I find you before the guards do. Do they have the mines guarding us? Someone other than us is poking around here. Well, these are the guys I was looking for. Well, that's pretty clear. They have mines? Alright, I'm gonna stick a moss arrow up there. Come out, come out, wherever you are. I'm not kidding. Come on out. And what? Right, moss is doing the job it needs to now. Well, if they had mines going to the entrance, the good news good news is I'm not gonna be stepping on those mines. I'll eventually find you, so why don't you just come on out? Okay. I wonder what's out this way. I don't know, but that's not where I need to go right now. Let's try to rip up here again. You know what? I'm going to end the episode here. So, uh, thanks for watching. And uh, when you come back for the next one, we'll go break into these villains' lair. See if we can find this stone slab, this key that uh, everybody seems to want. So, I'll see you soon.